Christian, the perfect result. Wasn't there on Saturday, you didn't get the pole, but you've got the big prize here in Miami. Well yeah, done. Yeah, it was a great recovery for Max. I mean, losing most of Friday, you know, not having any of the long runs and so on. And I think that, you know, a, a brilliant drive by him today. He made the pass when it needed. He had a good start. And then the pressure after that last safety car, you know, Charles was throwing everything at him. So uh, just enough to hang on there. It was actually quite quite confusing to understand where that pace came from the Ferrari after the safety car. Yeah. Was it just a cycle of the tyres at that stage? I think, you know, everything cools down. So I think, you know, they get their temperatures under control. They had a very good car in the first sector. And of course, with the three DRSs, we couldn't drop them. So every time you make a little gap, they're coming back with a DRS. And it took, I don't know, five, six, seven laps for Max to, you know, e gradually eke out that gap. And, you know, huge pressure for him. Uh, but you know, he made it count and, and then was able to manage the race. Yeah, I was in the, in the commentary box watching, imagining if he just, just one lock up, lock, yeah, one yeah. lock up and it could be all different. But anyway, he managed it beautifully. That's probably the hardest he's had to work for a victory. Physically, it was tough out there. Yeah, I mean, the temperature, you know, it's tremendously humid, very hot. And it's a demanding track, you know, the drivers you see, they've all uh, lost a few kilos today. And, uh, you know, Checo as well, I mean, he was managing a problem. so. You know, he did a did a great performance to even be getting anywhere near the Ferraris. Yeah, just the explain there. that uh, the Checo issue. There was a couple laps there where yeah. he seemed to be was it electrical. He wasn't he getting at the deployment. He, he uh, had a sensor go rogue on him on uh, one of the cylinders on the engine, and so then the guys have to move the things around. And uh, they did a great job recovering that. Um, but it, the deficit he had was probably close to 30 horsepower. So that's you know what nearly half a second a lap. So I think without that, with the grip advantage he had with the stop. I think uh, you know he would have he could have even been uh, P2 today. Yeah, well, it's still a strong result for the team. This battle between Leclerc and Max is yeah. going to continue, isn't it? It's, it's going to be another year like last year. <laughs> I'm resigning myself to that. This is going to go all the way through the year, which I think look, it's great for the sport, but uh, not good for the blood pressure. No, understandable. Well, go and enjoy the celebration. Right. Well Thanks done. a lot. All the best.